Section 23.8, Earth History in a Time Capsule. So everything we know about the past comes from what we understand about fossils and what we understand about rocks and how they interact and how knowledge of rocks that contain fossils can provide information about the rock's origin or the fossil's origin or vice versa depending on what the situation is. Now there are different types of fossils that can be found. Particularly fossils can be found where you have preservation of shells or hard parts of a particular organism. You can also have preservation of the shape of an organism. So you have a rock that forms over an organism and that organism is either removed and you're left with air in that space or the organism is removed and it's replaced with some other sediment so you get a cast of whatever that particular organism was. And you can also have the situation where the organisms are petrified and there's mineralization or replacement occurring within the organism itself. This is what happens with petrified wood. Finally, you can have fossils that show you signs of activity. So footprints or tunnels or nests or eggs. And so knowing the types of fossils and how they're formed, and knowing the types of rocks and how they're formed, and knowing how to date rocks relative to one another, and how to use radiometric dating to put direct years on each of the rocks. All of this information provides us everything we know about the history of Earth.